find the Thevenin equivalent of this circuit with respect to terminals A and B. I received many requests to post a video about the Thevenin equivalence, as I already have a video explaining the concept, but no videos actually finding the Thevenin equivalent through circuit analysis. So let's do that today. The idea of the Thevenin equivalent is to represent everything before terminals A and B as just a voltage source in series with a resistor, so that this setup would be electrically equivalent in the eyes of the terminals A and B. Now, typically, we would find the open circuit voltage, the short circuit current, and then divide them to find the Thevenin resistance. But in this particular case, I see potential for using source transformation, because we have a current source, a voltage source, some series resistors, some parallel resistors, so I see that potential there. By the way, I have a video explaining the source transformation technique, so if you haven't seen it yet, go and take a look at it. The first thing to notice is that we have a voltage source in series with a resistor over here. This can be replaced with a current source of 25 divided by 5, so that's 5 amperes, and then this 5 ohm resistor would come down in parallel. This helps because we have those two resistors in parallel now. 5 in parallel with 20 gives 4 ohms. And now, by our understanding of the circuit, we know that this resistor gets no current because we have an open circuit, no complete path for the current to flow. In other words, both current sources feed this 4 ohm resistor that is parallel over here, meaning that we can replace the two current sources with a single 8 ampere current source. And now, we can use source transformation once more to represent this as a voltage source in series with this 4 ohm resistor. 8 times 4 is 32 volts. So, we end up with a voltage source of 32 volts in series with this 4 ohm and the other 4 ohm resistor, giving us a total of 8 ohms in series like this. We stumbled upon the Thevenin equivalent of the original circuit, a voltage source in series with a resistor. So that's it. We're done. Using a series of source transformations ended up giving us the Thevenin equivalent directly, without any real circuit analysis.